Okay, this is podcast number six. And this is the size of the garden pile, which you can see is a lot smaller. And my poor grass is coming back finally. Now, this, I'm not really sure how I feel about all the work that's been done recently. The fact is, is that it feels like it's slowed down, but it probably doesn't look like for, it for you guys because you're getting weekly updates. But this... The lounge hasn't much changed, pasta has been in, um, and uh, what has changed is that we've got a new concrete floor where the fireplace was, that's so that the wood floor that we're getting put in will have somewhere nice and steady to step, step on. They've also done, put back the trim for the um, windows, and the door trim's on as well. Now the builder said I should take you round and do a view of the, the best view of the whole new area. Which he reckons is by standing in this corner. So we'll head over there and give you a good pan and view shot. So, kitchen, lounge, doorways. So that's what it's looking like at the moment. And as you can see they've done more, more concrete work there. There's been some slight issues with um, the uh, woodwork and the trim. See how much that's sticking out in terms of... Yes, well, that's because the guy in the 50s couldn't put an original window to save himself. So that's that. And we've got a new bulkhead above the where the kitchen cabinets are going to go, so I don't need to dust above the cabinets. Now, toilet is fully jibbed. Everything's completed here, just waiting for the plasterer. It smells a bit because we haven't got a toilet in, so there's nothing to trap, no stink traps in the Victorian manner. And then we have the bath in. So that's been placed in. It's a lot um, shallower a bath in terms of it's not so high to step in. And it's, um, you get tiles always along here and along there, so. That's pretty much where we're at at the moment.